<laughs> hey, Stuart, have you played a... Shoot, fighting oh, like this. Oh, that's you, Neo, or whatever the hell that is. Isn't yeah. really helpful. How is it? It's very good. I really oh. enjoyed it a lot. <laughs> we need to find the source of this problem. Why is he that one dude from... The Simpsons? Sonic, we need more information. Which character? I don't know, the, the scientist. Oh, Professor I Frank. Think. Yeah, I guess it kind of does sound like Professor Frank. I'm there are some missions, though, that do get a little... They do drag out a bit. Oh, that sucks. But... Sounds like a good and, and idea. The, Let's the story, go look around! <laughs> <laughs> the story has a lot to do with time travel. Which kind of oh, gets confusing It's Mr. Tanaka's times. house. Oh, it's Cream's house. But I very much... I enjoyed the music the most out of it. It's like intense where it's like rap rock and roll and then i want to say like english k-pop okay now hold on or english j-pop i should say this must be cream's house anyone but know? i recommend it on the ps4 not on switch because of frame rates oh what a surprise PS ps4 game but um ps5 Hi, Tails. good if you're looking for Creed, you just missed her. She died. She passed away she in a horrible died. accident. <laughs> She's dead. You hmm. missed her. I wonder where she went. Fucker, I just told you. Pitch. She's out with a new friend who also died. Sorry, I have 7,000 children. I don't, my mom. I don't recall her name. Her name is Purple. Establish this. But she had an interest in Purple Outfit. Exclamation oh, mark. Oh, Luigi stole cream. It's Wah. gotta be her. Well, Luigi and cream hanging out is not something I'd be okay with. No. <laughs> Ma'am, do you remember which way they were headed? Uh, Down that no. cliff. Thank you, ma'am. Let's go, Tails. Okay. Hold on. What was that? Did you see mom? Say that again, Matt. How often did you see Cream's mom? I mainly just in the show. I don't think she... maybe in battle. Advanced two. Is she in advanced two? Yeah. Kinda. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's Cream's whole purpose, and then Vanilla falls from the sky. Yeah, I mean, Cream's in a bunch of the games. The mom, not really. Vanilla, that's her name. Get it right, you fake Sonic fan. I'm the Cream, you're a mom. Got him. Wow. <laughs> I guess. How original. She's already been. How do you think I was born? I don't know, Sully on my toast. I don't know, dude. Mitochondria was too look, strong. Look, look, I don't, look, I don't know. I don't know how people are born, okay? Milo just it's appeared one day. Was born. <laughs> Still, still like a fetus, you know, the whole time. No, no, like, Whoa! I don't understand how... You motherfucker! <laughs> well, that sucks to be you, Michael. Actually, I'm very sorry to hear that. I'm sorry for your loss. It's true, you can't have it both ways. You can't say something mean and then just immediately say, never mind, something nice. He, what are you talking he can. about? <laughs> he's a sour path kid. He's sour, he's sweet, then he's gone. <laughs> <laughs> I die. <laughs> Or you just, just go off to a brand new adventure. I go to a farm. <laughs> <laughs> you go to a farm where you'll live happily forever. You will never see your steward again. Yeah. <laughs> it just shows a picture of Stork with a t single tear going down his face holding like a little... What are those things called? A sea monkey. <laughs> like, a, like a map back. Yeah. Just have just sea like monkeys. A bag on the, on the, on the Stort will go to a garden, uh, lost a forest where he'll be happy. You will never oh, see I your story you, again. There was a there was a bag over my head, like I was being kidnapped. No, we're doing the goodbye. Okay, hey Michael. Thing. Um, so here's the thing, right? Uh, when you hit those things, you need a boost. Right? Use the boost. Yeah. yeah. Um, yo, Stuart, So, uh, I haven't played the new uh, Xenoblade thing yet. The future redeemed. Yeah, but Rex talks to Shulk and is like, 
Yo, you're pretty lucky, you know. It must be pretty easy to have, like, your your kid is pretty good. And I'm like, dude, look, you have three kids, all right, Rex? <laughs> like... Yeah, I know. Like, yeah, it's easy, because he has one kid. You have three. <laughs> I haven't of either, is like... Easier. The timeline is so weird that I just I hate don't it. understand I don't it. get it. No, I don't get it. Like, apparently this is a prequel to the third one, so... In reality, I shouldn't care about this at all. But I sure do. I, because I wanna... it already, you know, it already happened. It's already passed. The day's been saved. But you like, always know the day is going to be saved in those games, don't you? Sure. Not, not always. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Sometimes Sometimes you always. might destroy the day. This just some nonsense they're putting in, like code. Yes. Wait, Cope? That's in Sonic 1. Yeah, well, this one says Blaze. Uh. Just like how it says Cope in Sonic 1. Oh, yeah. You know what's how great about it? Go. You know what's great about this is that, like, not like anyone cares, but Blaze is new to this universe, and yet she has a poster here. <laughs> like Tails did in Sonic 2. I think what just confuses me about this whole future redeemed thing for Xenoblade is that people were saying... I don't know if this is canon or whatever, but, like, they've solved everything, and they mentioned how the, the main character, Matthew, is, like, the uncle of of one of the main characters in Xenoblade 3, who is also a daughter of this person in a different cycle of Rebirth, and I just... And then the timeline just kept getting weirder and weirder, that Rex not only has, like, three children, but he has more because of the cycles. <laughs> oh, and then some, and then some is, people... I'm on the up him. And, and then some people's, like, you know, their daughters or, or sons are actually older than them because, you know, the, the father was in a, is, was in that rebirth cycle, so they're, like, fucking four years old again. <laughs> no, okay, hold on. Somebody needs to, like, stop Rex from having kids. And it's like, why did this turn into British people and now it's just a bunch of fucking fetus baby reincarnations? <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to play it and probably be upset, but, you know... Or I might enjoy it. I have no clue. I don't know. I haven't played it either. I just... I, I kind of just don't feel like going back to it. I want to go back to it, but that's just because I liked 3 a lot. I did too, but I think I was at a point where I stopped playing it for a bit and just wanted to get it over with. Yeah. God damn it! kind of sucks, because like, I'm feeling that again with Marvel's Midnight Suns, where like I just want to be over. Yeah. I also, um, I'm also that way with, um, the Fire Emblem DLC. That one was weird. It was just like, it's an alternate universe where the bad guys were good and the good guys were bad. Ooh. Yeah, ho-ho, where the good guys were bad and the bad guys were good, except for the fact that the good guys aren't really that bad of guys. Fucking. Yeah, I don't know. That's weird. I think I also just, I don't like the thing about games coming out and all of a sudden hey you, you spend 30 more bucks you get a dlc that will happen like you know a year and a half later you spend 30 bucks and you might get a story wave one is one character that you may or may not care about and some other costumes i think in wave two what's that nothing we didn't do wave two and wave three is a story you'll get the japanese soundtrack <laughs> that's it Did it. Oh, uh, what happened? You're fine. What? Why did it do that? The lights like... are turned off. Yeah, this is the level I got stuck on when I was playing on the DS, but I also, okay, like... Okay, you see that thing right there? Yeah. No. That's why you That's... get to the special stage, right? It sure is. Don't do this one. Yeah, I had that in a previous level, when I tried getting it to work, but I was, like, struggling, but I'll just... I'll, yeah, I'll figure it out. I don't remember where in this level I was having a hard time, but there does come a point in this level where I was struggling. Alright, back up. Who's King Kirby shaming? All of them. Uh, Alright. Sex is gross. Yeah, sure. 
Remember, kids, Sonic says don't have sex. Unless you're married. Yeah. Married. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that was, it's that predictable. That, well, it's that predictable, but, like, also, um, at the time when I saw that joke, I did not expect that from a Simpsons joke. <laughs> oh, yeah. What Sonic said in The Simpsons. Oh, uh, there's a Simpsons billboard where, like, it's Amy proposing to. Uh, no, Knuckles. Sonic fucking. Yeah, no, Amy Sonic Amy propos proposing to Knuckles. <laughs> uh, Sonic proposing to Amy, and it says, don't have sex before marriage. That shit made me laugh really hard only because I wasn't ready for it at that time. There is, like, yeah, there was, like, seeing Sonic in The Simpsons always threw me off. Like, the, the first one, the most famous one. Was the uh, Joss? Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. If anyone knows what that is about, uh, no. it's the company's fault for making you want it so much. Or do you not know that one, Chris? No. Oh, that one's okay. hilarious because there, it, 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 it was, it was Just referenced. Take it. it was referenced okay. by official Sonic too. Like, so there's an episode of The Simpsons where Bart is like, con like considering shoplifting. And then a bunch of video game characters, because he wants to steal a video game, a bunch of video game characters pop up and encourage him to do it. There's Mario, Luigi, Donkey Kong, and then uh, um, Sonic shows up and just starts shouting, Just take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it! And then okay, so when we get back to Hollow Victories, just, not Hollow Victories. <laughs> TV dinners. When we get back to TV dinners, um, just show me every episode. Honestly, every episode God, with Sonic in it. The one, that one episode, and it's not just because Sonic's in it. That is like one of my top ten episodes of the show. That's like a fantastic episode. Like it, it explores Marge and Bart's relationship in a way that I think is very like fascinating. Like it's one of the best of the show, hands down. <laughs> the uh, Bart, we are going to bond. But what's really funny about it is Bart. like. It's one of the. It, it actually got referenced by official Sonic because in the Lego Dimensions game, if you have uh, Bart and Sonic paired up, um, Sonic will start. Will, will say that to Bart. <laughs> like Roger that's Craig funny. Smith's voice will say that to Bart, and that's. The, I think that's really funny. Yeah, not Sonic. Roger did Craig we, Smith. Get it right. Did we? Uh, did Did we pause the game for that? Yeah, I wanted to explain that. Yeah. How's that game gonna help your putting? Just take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take that. Hey Bart, remember, if you see a gold brick lying around, just take it! Take it, take it, take it, take it! Take it! No, I love that shit. Oh fuck. I almost gonna, died for it. I almost died for this. I almost died for it. Oh, oh no, you're not gonna make it back up. You, right. You're just gonna have to be on the bottom screen. New path. <laughs> Go. Be Go. careful though. Oh yeah, this part this level this level's hard. This is like the first level of the game that I would, like, consider to be kind of challenging. I remember dying here a lot. Yeah, like, right there! Like <laughs> I even got another life and just lost it. Let's not do it! Let's go home and kick back and relax. And play Is LEGO it... Dimensions. Is it really my issue? Blaze can handle it. Yeah, this is the first Blaze level. I think I remember just hating Blaze's first level, which was this. Yeah. Which is Blaze's first level. Ah! Which just so happened to be this. Imagine Sonic cheating on his wife. <laughs> Elise? Never. He's been cheating on Madonna since the 90s. Imagine if they did go that route. It's funny, because Madonna does exist in, like, Archie's canon. Good. I didn't know that, yeah, honestly. No, like, yeah, no, she's there. <laughs> that's funny. She's there for one comic and that's it. Okay, that still still counts. Roger Rabbit. Roger Rabbit. Jessica Rabbit. Yeah, that's what that is what they tried to do with Sonic. <laughs> I mean, I yes, Sonic just... was a rabbit for a second, wasn't he? <laughs> he was. I wasn't even saying that. I was talking about Jessica Rabbit, but yeah, like like the Jessica animal rabbit. And... The animal and woman pair up, but... The same enemy keeps hitting you. <laughs> it's weird in this game to fight them because it's like... It's better to avoid them, you yeah. Can't, you can't really do a proper homing attack in this game. No, no you cannot. Like, there's that, but it's not... It doesn't lock on to them, really. It locks on, it's just it's not consistent on where you hit them. It's very easy to fall off the edge doing that. 
Oh, it's also very. If you use it, you'll learn very just quickly. Just like and smash. Bro. Yeah. Well, it's easy to also just uh, hit them in the wrong spot with their um, hitbox hurt. The fuck you want to call it? I don't think they answer. I swear to God. Okay. I don't think in Xenoblade they answer what happened to Fiora and Pyra. They just don't feel like dealing with it. Oh, well, it's simple. They had a kid, and then that's it. <laughs> they went that's off on the... adventures. Yeah, that's it. They, they had a child and ceased to exist. That's upsetting. What? Why? What the fuck was that? Giving birth and then dying. <laughs> 